here we are, October 20th, 2008, Labyrinth's annual Big Gala Throwdown Celebrity Charades. It's uh, charades as a blood sport. Four teams of celebrities playing charades to kill. <laughs> I think it's been going on seven years, maybe, I'm not sure. The Labyrinth Theatre is a fan wonderful theatre. They do great new work, and Phil Hoffman is in the plays sometimes. He directs them. He's got a company that's one of the few ongoing companies in the United States, actually, but certainly in New York, there aren't that many of them. And I play charades. This will be the third time. I love to play charades, I love the Labyrinth Theatre, and I'm very excited to be here tonight. They've sort of roped me into doing this. I'm so scared right now about this, because I don't know if you know these company members, but they are so competitive. It's going to get ugly. I should have stayed in the audience, because <laughs> I'm, I'm a little nervous. you just got to be quick. Don't stall out. Um, sometimes people get stuck, and then they give no clues. You just say something. Movie, play, song, book, you know, small word, sounds like... Film, television, book, um, play. What's play? I think play is like this, song. Especially if you've studied Meisner, then you can really dive in, you know, and, and really take on the clue. And, let, and, and find the clue within you. Keep your mind open for ideas. No censorship. Blurt it out, which gets really funny. Um, and yeah, never give up. You know, frankly, um, no one really asked me about this, but I've never played charades, not once in my whole life, and I don't even know the rules. So luckily no one will see this until after it's over, but I don't know why they asked me to judge. I've literally never played charades, and I don't even know the rules. I'm glad that the Labyrinth actually came up with the idea, because you wouldn't want to crib it, because everybody knows that only the Labyrinth can do charades for a night. And only Labyrinth can get people to pay money to watch other people play charades. I wouldn't want to do it in public. Would you want to play charades in public with a bunch of people like watching? I wouldn't. It's it's actually kind of a great thing. I mean, people are better at this than they should be. I don't know what they're actually doing all day that they have this much expertise at charades, but it's a good group. But there's a very enthusiastic and almost sort of Roman spectator audience thing going on with people screaming for blood and winners and losers. It's a goodly amount of excitement. But it's a great idea and it's really important, particularly in today's day when People are losing all their money and they're giving less and less money to the theater. I'm so glad that we're at a big space um, so that we can raise money for this theater company because it's an important theater company and it's got a lot of important artists um, in the company and I will never miss it. It's anybody's guess as to what tonight's going to be like, but I, I guarantee some excitement.